Hello friends, in this video we will see another problem based on sum plus no is equal to sum not rule. Okay, sum plus no is equal to sum not rule. Okay, sum plus no will give sum not. Okay, so in the previous video we have seen one example based on this rule. So in this video we will see another example based on this rule. Okay. So let us consider two given syllogisms are some trains are some trains are trees some trains are trees and next syllogism given is no tree is a picture no tree is a picture and the first conclusion given is some trains are some trains are picture some trains are pictures and the second conclusion given is no train is a picture no train is a picture okay so if the given conclusion one is alone true we have to select option a if two is alone true then we have to select option b either one or either either one or two is true then we have to select c if both are false then we have to select D. If both are true, then we have to select E. Okay. So now let's come to the uh, given two syllogisms. If you observe this one, the first one is starting with sum and second one is starting with no. And the predicate of the first uh, syllogism is equivalent to the subject of the second syllogism. Here is also tree. Here is also a tree. Okay. So that means actually we can apply the sum plus no is equal to sum not true. So, from whatever we are deriving from the given two syllogisms is going to be start with sum according to the rule of sum plus no is equal sum not. Okay, sum. So, then we take the predicate from the first syllogism that is sum trains are. Sum trains are. So, then we use not. Then we use not. Sum trains are not. And then we take the predicate from second syllogism that is picture. So, sum trains are not picture. Some trains are not pictures. Okay, so some trains are not pictures. And the second, uh, from the first uh, given syllogism alone, we can derive if some trains are trees, then some trees are also trains. So that means some trees are trains. Some trees are trains. Okay, if no tree is a picture, then no picture is also a so that means from second statement alone, I mean second syllogism alone, we can uh, conclude that uh, otherwise we can derive a fact that is no picture is a no picture is a tree. Okay. So this one, the first uh, conclusion we derived using the rule and second we derived using the first syllogism alone and third one we derived alone from the second given second syllogism given. Okay. So now, now the whatever we derived, compare that one with the already given conclusion. Some trains are picture, but here we have some trains are not picture. So that means the first one is false. The first one is false. Why? Because here we got some trains are not picture, but here we got some trains are picture. So both are opposite. So first one is false. Here we got no train is a picture. So here no picture is a tree and some trees are trains. And here, if you observe this one, no train is a picture. Actually, there is a connection between tree and picture using no. But actually, there is no connection between train and picture using no. So that's why this one is also a false. So both are false. So that means we have to select the option D when both are false. Okay. So I hope uh, you got this uh, some plus no will give the conclusion with some not rule. So Thank you very much for watching this video and please subscribe my channel.